Yo guys, what's going on? Weirdness here. And as I said in my last video that I was just pretty much just ranting. Um, I was gonna go live, but I ended up not going live. I'm definitely gonna go live again, like later today around like probably eight or nine. It really, really depends. But uh, I'll probably even go live even earlier. Honestly, it depends. But like what I was pretty much saying is how like I just I just need content friends. Because I have friends, but it's like, I really, I can't, like, I will say depend on them, really. And, you know, I usually thrive when I have people to, like, to vibe with on my own. But at the same time, it is what it is. Like, maybe I can find me some random friends on just, just by playing, like, games like Apex Legends. If I do the 3v3, maybe I can find a squad. I mean, I've been having, I've been finding friends, actually. Pretty recently, I've been finding a few friends, and you know we've been playing some games. So um, we'll see, we'll see. Hopefully, I can find me some actual decent friends, you know, to collab with, and you know, hopefully, even get a friend group going, you know, so we can do like pure content, you know, start growing with each other and stuff like that. Because you know, you is it? It's I wouldn't say it's necessarily harder. To go solo, but in my opinion, I say it's it's easier to thrive with others because if you have friends who like doing who like playing games and possibly even doing content, you can grow with each other, and it's like it's better that way in my opinion because then you know. You just chill, grow, you know, have fun while you're playing. You know, you don't have to play with randoms. Because sometimes randoms, a lot of the time, it's not sometimes. It's usually a lot of the times randoms are bad. I'm going to just say it. Randoms are bad. Every, any um, team-based game that I played and I had randoms, they was usually very, very bad. Now, occasionally, you'll run into, like, a good random and maybe you become friends. I mean, that's what happened when I was in my Black Ops 3 days. You know, I was really, really dominant in Black Ops 3. Then um, I ended up joining a clan called Gods. And it was it was, it was fun. I, I miss those days, honestly. Because it felt like back then, I didn't need to depend on, like, some people. You know, because we had a whole clan. So, you know, if anyone wants to play, we can play. Now, usually I still did play solos. But I it will cut. I only reason I play solos is because it was more fun for me, and I still dominated, even though my team was usually bad. Like, bro, I swear if I can go back and show you guys some of like my old screenshots of how I played, bro, I I did so well. I mean, I think I still I don't know if I still have the live streams up. I think I still have live streams of me playing like Black Ops Three and me just being dominant, dude. Freaking going, dropping 50 kills per game. 50. My highest steal to this day, and I don't think I will ever beat that, was 73. No, 72 and 3 in TDM, bro. And TDM, it was up to 100. So I've gotten more than half of, I got like 75% of the kills. Like, I was really, really dominant. And it was very fun because, you know, every once in a while, we had our friends, you know, that would join us, you know, the clan, the clan, we just vibe, bro, we just vibe, get killed, dominate lobbies, you know, it was just so fun, that's why I always, will always, always treasure Black Ops 3 over any game that I've ever played, because in Fortnite, I've always played Fortnite basically by myself, and, um, you know, back in, like, when Crossplay first came out, I did play with Slayer a lot, but we, like, Sometimes we play, but sometimes we don't. You know, it's not like how it used to be when we was in school. Like, pretty much after school, we usually just probably go home, take a nap, then wake up and we'll play. Um, nowadays, it's not really like that anymore. And I'm usually independent by myself, so it's like I'm used to it by now. So, I mean, I, I have my girlfriend, but the only problem is she's, like, we're opposites, opposites, bro. Like, she's, like west coast and i'm all the way over here on the east so it's like it's harder for us to play because of that of that fact alone because i don't want her to be like i mean even though she doesn't care genuinely she doesn't care she does she really don't care she's very cool 
But inside, I actually care because of the fact that it's like it's an unfair advantage because she like it lags her and she like can't play to her best ability in my opinion. And she's really good, man. even though she says she's not. She's really really good at Fortnite, honestly. But um. Anyways, let me get back to the topic at hand before I get completely lost, which I pretty much already have. Um, but, um, yeah, I need, hopefully, I mean, like, this video most likely ain't even going to reach out to, like, any, like, heavy content creators who, because, bro, I have so many games that I possibly want to play in the future. And I even have a lot of solo games, like, here, I'll pop this up right now, because I'm downloading a game as we talk. So, um, I got... Cluster Truck, I just got Control again, I have Fallout, and I have this game called I Am Fish, it's new, it's really, really new, so, um, I haven't installed, so I'm gonna just start playing, like, solo games, honestly, cause, until Battle, oops, I'm sorry, I hit my mic, but until, like, the new Battlefield comes out, I'm probably just gonna be mainly sticking to solo games and hopping on Fortnite here and there, um, but I'll also be playing Apex every once in a while, but until Apex, like, fix their damn servers, I won't re really be playing Apex. But, you know, I still get Apex content in there because, in my opinion, Arena is more fun than Battle Royale. Like, Arena is so damn fun, bro. It's just a small little area. Like, I'm pretty sure a lot of you already know what Apex is, but just in case you don't, um, I'm going to explain it, see? So, Arena is pretty much a small little area, you know. you It's like, it's like CSGO. Because I'm pretty sure CSGO is the one who started that trend. But it's like, CSGO, you start with a starter weapon. And then um, after that, you, like, get more money. And you can buy, like, better weapons. You can upgrade your weapons. Um, you can't buy shield because it's already pre-shield. So whatever shield you have, it, it is what it is. But, yeah, it, it's honestly, it's, it's the most, it's so fun and so enjoyable. Like, I don't play Apex. I don't play the Battle Royale version of Apex because that's just... It's it's not that it's hard, but it's just a third-party Festa. And you you can be... Literally, you find a team. You can start shooting at that team. And if the fight takes too long, which it usually will, and nine times out of ten, they're going to get you low, which is why um shield swapping is a huge, huge meta. But nine times out of ten, you're going to get third-partied. And usually, what can happen is you can get pinched in between. And, like, a lot of people don't like that, including myself. But I will, and that's mainly why I, I, honestly, honestly, that's why I dropped Apex, honestly. But, um, Arena is, has been keeping me around. Um, I know Hamlin's, he, uh, recently started playing Apex too. Um, Battle Royale is cool for him, but like like I said, you could get pinched really easily. It's such a third party festa game. It's like third party on crack, basically. Um, and I always like I always say, I want another Fortnite type battle royale. Honestly, um, it's just I don't know. It's something about Fortnite I love, bro. Maybe not. Maybe something new, not probably like not with building, but something like Fortnite models type, you know. But they make their own models at least, you know, own skins. Cause I like skins. I really, really, really like skins. Like I don't like skins on guns, but I like skins on characters because characters are more unique in my opinion. And I like pickaxes too, you know. Fortnite got me into pickaxes, and as you guys don't know, um. My favorite pickaxe is Raiders Revenge. It always will be because it's the most unique pickaxe in the game, in my opinion. And Death Valley. Death Valley is definitely up there in uniqueness because it's so unique and so good. Man, it's so good. But uh, I'm going to most likely quit doing these like ranting slash talking videos and just mainly focus on the content. But, like, if you guys really want me to, like, continue doing these types of ranting slash talking videos, then I will, honestly. Because I, myself, I don't mind doing them. I really like doing these. In my opinion, I love doing these ranting slash talking videos. They're, they're very, very enjoyable to me. And I just, I overall, I overall just enjoy them. But um, it's really up to you guys, honestly. But, anyway, that's pretty much being said. Um, 
just do a quick summary. I pretty much need like friends slash like content creators who actually want to do content. Um, probably like people who's reliable, which is very hard to find in my opinion. Very hard to find reliable people, bro, because yeah, you can be playing with people one day, the next day, you know, they disappear. It is what it is. Everyone has to like own personal reason, own like personal crap. And you know, I ain't gonna fault them for it. It is what it is, bro. Like, I'm not about to ask people every day if they want to like play, bro. Like, if you want to play, we can play. Like, I'm not no damn puppy. I'm not gonna ask, bro. I just find me some new people, new people, new friends to vibe with. Like, I did today, I found new people in Fortnite. Honestly. I, that was the most fun I've had in Fortnite in such a damn long time. Since probably the OG lobby thing I did. And, they, it was, dude, it was like two people. Two people had a mic, one person didn't have a mic. But, they were just so damn chill, bro. They was like, really honestly chill. And the dude without a mic was even chill. Even though he didn't have a damn mic, you know. It's just chill people, bro. Like, honestly. But, um, yeah, it is what it is. Like I said in my last video as well, you know, I know who's been here pretty much since the beginning, who's not going to up and disappear, you know, when something happens, and who's basically just stuck around. You know, I don't got time for that fake energy for bro. And, like, I have, like, my main core of people that I for bro know. Like, okay, you know what? Like, the main, main people that, I mean... I'll say, okay, so number one is, of course, my girlfriend. Then we got Code. Then we got my boy, um, ah, uh, dude, why am I blanking out? So we got my girlfriend, Code. Code is fucking, like, the, literally a fucking homie. His name is a Chia on YouTube. Um, Why? It sucks. I, I I'm I literally have any memory at the moment. But um Helm, he usually comes to my stream usually all the damn time. Like literally all the time. Um actually I'm gonna text him right now, literally. I'm literally about to text him. Cause he's literally he's always in my damn stream. Like always. You know what? Let me go to my stream real quick. Hopefully all my VODs aren't deleted. But I'm going to go to my stream real quick. And he's usually, literally all the damn time. Like, he's such, he's such a homie. Sorry if this taking a little bit. Um, I'm trying to hope that I find him. Oh, Corbinator. Corbinator is another one, another homie. Julius is his name. Julius. Bro, so we got Julius Corbinator. Mr. Stealth is usually in my, um, crap, too. He's even, Mr. Stealth, bro, like, honestly, even though we really don't talk, like, even, like, if you made it this far, bro, like, Mr. Stealth, I'm gonna be personal with you, homie. Like, you're dead ass an OG, bro, like, dead ass. You're, like, literally the most OG person that I've known, who's, like, still been here. Slayer's here and there. My man Slayer, he be here one day, gone the next day. It, it is what it is. But I know for a fact, Mr. Stealth is like literally the OG OG. Like this, this dude, I, dude, bro, I'm surprised, bro. I thought after we got out of high school, he wasn't even going to watch me anymore. Because I know he watched me during high school. My man even played some of my videos out loud, bro. I got embarrassed, bro, low key. It's not that it's cringe, it's just embarrassing, low key. Because, I don't know. It's Sometimes it's weird just to hear my voice again. But, um, I know Mr. Self's an OG for sure, for sure, so, and, um, yeah, so, I mean, that's pretty much it, honestly. It's, like, maybe five, maybe five to six people who, like, truly, truly support me for real, and I, I really fuck with it. But, um, uh, I'm gonna start streaming again, also, if you guys don't know, like I said in my last video, I'm going to start streaming. I'm gonna upload these videos on the same day as well, so, yeah, double upload, which is rare for me to do nowadays, but after I do these double uploads, I'm gonna fucking, later on today, 
when I wake up, not when, as soon as I wake up, because I'm most likely relaxed for a bit and stuff, but later on today, I'm going to give me some Apex content on Arena, and just start uploading that, because I really need to get content out, and I, like I always say, I want to be a content creator, I just need people to vibe with, and that's always hard on me, because... You know, I'm kind of awkward in a way at first. After a while, I do open up, but I'm, like, awkward at first. And, you know, hopefully I'll find me some people to vibe with. Maybe some people in the Apex community. Like I said, um, anyways, I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm sorry for this being so long. And I would definitely catch you guys in the next video. Like I said, it's always better to grow with, grow with the group. Always. Always. But. Catch you guys in the next video. Hard times at the moment. But it's all cool. You know what? I'm not even going to edit this. Because it is what it is. Also got to figure out what the hell this um, headset um, thingy is. It's like not showing no bars. So that's kind of weird. But. Catch you guys in the next video. Ooh. Excuse me. Peace.